Good morning, everybody. Matt Shaver here, and I just wanted to show you a new trick that I've been working on for using Vim inside of iTerm2. Um, so the plugin that I put together is called Vim iSlime2. Um, currently at uh, commit number 37C, so if you're looking at this a little bit later, I might have added some features, tweaked some things since then. Um, so I've already included this in my Vim configuration. And uh, you'll see that what I have here is uh, just a basic iTerm2, um, but I have a split opened up. And what Vim iSlime2 lets you do is send uh, commands to the next split. So it actually uses Apple Script to just use command right and left, um, or sorry, command right, left, or right bracket and left bracket to actually switch back and forth between the two screens. And uh, the upshot of this is in my Vim, I can press uh, leader FT in a test file, and you'll see it sends a uh, script test and then the path to the test uh, over into that buffer. And uh, it doesn't necessarily have to be just script test. This is just my personal convention. Um, you can do let t i slime to last command equal pretty much whatever you want, right? So just to give you an example that I'll actually pass, I could do my Ruby dash i test, cucumber, r spec, um, you know, whatever, uh, whatever you like to do. Um, and then it uses that last command, um, which will get set when you run a test command, uh, every time you run leader ff, um, which just pushes whatever's in that last command register over to the next screen. Um, I'm working on a couple other things. I have a helper for rake. Um, I am going to be releasing a helper for uh, focused unit testing as well. Um, and I'd also like to write a script test library that actually knows how to switch between tests and specs and, uh, and cucumber tests and that sort of thing uh, in the near future. Um, I think this is pretty handy. It basically lets me have my editor and my uh, test running window um, both in the same frame, right? So I don't have to command tab around. I just do browser back to uh, terminal, browser back to terminal without having to think about that extra step in the middle. Um, and because this is uh, iTerm tabs as opposed to screen or tmux, um, I don't have uh, I don't have to enter any sort of key combo or even give the pane focus um, in order to uh, scroll back and take a look at test history, that sort of thing. Um, so I like this and maybe you will too. Check it out. Um, feel free to send me a pull request and uh, hopefully talk to you soon. Bye.